once again. Again, again. At this home off of Military Road South, major crimes detectives are investigating after a homicide. It's the second homicide investigation in three months' time. My reaction was, well, maybe now they can close it down. Ronald Hendrickson says the latest problem at this property happened in the early morning hours. The King County Sheriff's Office says the call for help came in, reporting a fight and a shooting. Deputies arrived and found the front door open, one man dead and a second man hurt. Investigators spent time collecting evidence here today, and back in November, they were here too. We actually heard the, the explosion of that tank. It woke us up. After an explosion, a body was found on the property. At the time, the King County Sheriff's Office put out this request for information, saying that it is believed the victim was killed at the scene and the fire set immediately afterward to destroy evidence and hinder the investigation. Then there's police activity up there for probably two and a half days straight, and then they left and then everybody just came back. Neighbors who know the owner say people have been staying on his property. I've told him before, I'm like, what do you got these guys here for? Get them out of here, man, they're no good. A push to make this place safer has Hendrickson calling on the county. Just to close it down and not let them come back in. He says that's the solution. That's what we're hoping for. Now, so far this afternoon, we have not been able to reach the property owner to ask him about neighbors' concerns. What we can tell you is both homicides that brought investigators to the property are still open and active investigations. Reporting live tonight, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.